Yo, 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 welcome b -b -b back to Jay's Game Pad. Anyway, today is a good day, a semi good day. It would have just been a flat out amazing godlike day, but it's a really good day, should I say. Do you know why? Because The Last of Us Part 2 is out, and I have literally just picked up my collector's edition from Game, and I'm going to do a quick unboxing for you people out there that want to see the quality and the content of the classic edition. So you know what? Let's bring this box up here. Booyah! Booyah! The Last of Us Part 2. It was a interesting round. The PlayStation logo, the Naughty Dog logo, and the Last of Us Part 2. This is basically the stuff that's in the back. Uh, PS4 dynamic themes, set of six pin avatars, sorry, PSN avatars, soundtrack, mini art book from Dark Horse. And obviously you've got the figurine, uh, the still, was it the still bookcase, the art book, a little thank you note I think, and the pins and stickers and Eddie's bracelet. Yeah, so as you can see. Okay, so let's open this up. Actually, let me... People, kids, don't play with knives. Only adults. And even then, be careful when you use knives. Okay. Open that up. Oh, what's this? Do you know what? Yeah, it's got like these handles where like these handles where you pull it up. I've never seen that before, like in the touch edition. Because normally I always struggle to get like the box in the box out, which is like super annoying. Oh, there we go. Shuffle that to one side. There's a little hand I was talking about. Okay. So the box in the box. The last of us part two. Pretty was it's pretty much an all black box with just the uh, was it the logo, the like the name of the game. So let's slide this off. I love the way like like fresh box smell. Like you can smell it. It's like when you get trainers or something, or you just got that really fresh smell. Okay, so let's get these out. So we've got the Last of Us stickers. We all love stickers, so that's cool. Actually, so we can see how many they give us. So we've got the. Uh, Naughty Dog ones, black and white. Got the Last of Us Part 2 one. Black and white. And Ellie's tattoo. So that's quite cool. Then we've got, I think this is, yeah, this is Ellie's bracelet, which is quite cool as well. Um, so you can see the quality. If, it, was it, if it's quality or quality, that quality is next level. So let's have a look. I don't think it is. is it leather? I think it might be leather. Okay. You know what they say, not sure, smell it. So, so yeah, that's actually quite cool, I like that. It's got the all seeing eye, I think. Is that, is that all seeing eye? That's like, like a Turkish one, I swear it is. Anyway. Then we've got the uh, badges, which is cool. Because I'm pinning them, was it pinning these on a few jackets or what? So that's super cool. Uh, let's see what else is there. Let's get that over there. Then we've got the art book, which is super cool. I'll show you a few pages. I won't show you everything, just in case you like, want to get it. But I'll show you a few pages. Okay. Let's see, we've got a few pages right there. Basically, character designs and stuff. Yeah, this is super cool. I love art books, and it's done by Dark Horse. Yeah, Dark Horse, Dark Horse always, uh, to be honest with you, Dark Horse um, does a lot of the collector's edition art books, that's something one of my So they cornered that little market as well, which is cool. Uh, what is this? I'm actually not sure what this is. This might be the welcome, actually. So, okay, so. 
Okay, yeah. yeah. So it's a welcome note. One of them days. So yeah, so we've got the main, well, one of the main attractions, one of the main features. We've got Ellie and oh my god, okay, golfer girl. We've got the golfer girl on one side, and you've got Ellie. That kind of tells you a lot, doesn't it, for people that know about the spoilers and stuff like that. It's not a good look. Anyway, let's put that to the side. Oh, actually, let's, let's have a look. Oh, it's two discs. I completely forgot. It's actually two discs. Okay, so you've got the white one and the black one. Actually, I, I, I did hear the game really, really big. Really, really big. And I, I don't mind showing this code because by the time I upload it, I would have used it, so it's cool. But yeah, this is the still got case, which is quite cool. Got the last of us and the dog paw print on the spine. Right there, cool. And on to the main attraction, the main feature, the main. Actually, put this down. Uh, so I can get out of here. Slide up. Let's see. Baby girl, come on. Because oh, yeah. we don't care about the boxes once we open them. Oh wow. Quality. Quality. That's all I have to say about this figurine. Not quality. Quality. Look everybody. I don't know if you can see. Strumming the guitar, you know, just ah oh, damn. And look at what's it? Look at the um, you know what I mean, like the machete, like the blade. It's all got blood stains on it. Oh, the violence, the violence. You know, the attention to detail on this figurine is just amazing. But it was the same. But it was the same with the um, Uncharted Four one as well. So like, look, was it? Look, look at the blood stains there. Fucking sick. Let's see a rock and the Chuck Taylors. Naughty dog. Uh, Naughty dog, man. They went in with the figurine. You know I mean, but they always do, though. They always do. And it feels quite heavy, to be honest with you. Like the base is hollow, but the actual figurine is solid. I can feel it. It's solid. Like they, you know what I mean? Like they spared no expense when they like made this figurine. And you know what? For a hundred and sixty pound, can't complain. You really can't complain. Like they give you a lot. That is fucking beautiful. Look at you, Ellie. Ah, <sighs> my girl, my girl, baby girl. Let's put you there. Let's put you there safe. Cool one, her safe. And because I pre-ordered it with game, we actually got some bonus stuff. More stuff. So what they did is that they gave us. So they actually gave us some badges, which is cool. And they gave us Last of Us Part 2 key ring. You can see that actually let me open this. So, yeah, so that's cool. And it's funny because my actual key, no, my actual key ring busted the other day, it broke. So that's a touch I actually need this. So yeah man, you know what I'm saying, like pre-ordered it from game 160, Texas edition, they gave us extra stuff as well, which is sick, can't complain. Actually to be honest with you, to be honest with you, I don't think he was even meant to, but I just think. And it's funny as well because um, the store we went to, there was only three pre-orders of, of the Texas edition and that was me, my friend and someone else. And I was expecting there to be a queue and there was no queue, so it was like, damn, I don't, I don't people care about this game, don't people want this game? But um, you know I mean, if you don't know, I mean, game's been quite. You know I mean, quite. Um, it was it been quite crazy with all the spoilers and stuff and all the fuckeries. But what I will say is that um, if you have an interest in the game, you're looking forward to get the game and stuff like that. I would say get it and play it for yourself. 
regardless of what you're seeing or what you're hearing. Make up your own choice, make up your own decisions. And after that, if you think the game is good or you think it's okay, you think it's amazing, you think it's straight trash and garbage, then say that, like, you know, like in your rights. You know what I mean? But I always say for people to um, you know, experience things for themselves. But yeah, bam, I'm with it. I'm, I'm majorly happy with this. I'm majorly happy with this, you know. But actually, I think that there was actually two, was it two um, things we did? One was you got a bow and arrow, and there's this one. And I think it depends on what region you lived in, if I'm not mistaken. But this is really important. So this is going up on my shelf with the rest of my collectors, editions, and figurines. Uh, actually, I'll probably put a list to Nathan Drake. Yeah. Anyway, so thank you for watching this unboxing. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, they gave us good content, good quality in, in terms of the actual Plex edition and what's in the box and stuff. I have no complaints. It's well worth 160, in my personal opinion, so far. And yeah, all there is to do is to play the game. So thank you for watching, and I'll speak to you soon.